How's it going, everybody? Poser Mobile here, back with another week of Fashion Report coverage. It's week 343. As always, shout out to Kyoko Star for all the fantastic work they do with theory crafting to make the Fashion Report so easy every week. All right, so starting off with the easy 80 point version, we only need one piece of gear for this a set of extreme survival slops. This is crafted gear, so you can grab these from the market board if you want. Aside from that, we need one shadow blue die, which you can grab from the market board to save you time and gill, and two bark brown die, which you can grab from Nanabe, the independent merchant in Ulda. Once you've got your stuff, equip your extreme survival slops and dye them shadow blue, then dye any dyeable chest piece bark brown, and dye any dyeable feet piece bark brown. Teleport over to the Golden Saucer, and teleport over to Wonder Square East. Hop down over the railing and present yourself for judging at the masked rose. He'll do his usual speech, and there you go. Easy 60,000 MGP. All right, so now for the easy 100-point fashion leader version. First, you're going to need a set of Tantalus Breaches. You get this from the 150-day veteran reward. So if you haven't been subscribed that long, just wait until next week for your fashion leader title. You can grab them from the Calamity Salvager in Ulda by the Blue Mage Trainer if you didn't hold on to them. Next, you're going to need to get an Animos Jacket. I would recommend just getting this from the market board if, rather than doing Eureka content trying to get it. Next, you're going to need to get a set of Dreadworm Bracers of Scouting. These drop from the chest after the boss in the final coil of Bahamut turn 3, and they're set to Ninja and Viper. So if you haven't leveled Ninja, you can just quickly unlock Viper and use them as that class. That's all we need for gear, so now it's time to buy some dyes. We need three Loam Brown, as well as one Shadow Blue, both of which you can grab from the market board to save you time and gill. Once you've got those all bought, you need to have any dyeable weapon dyed Loam Brown, your Animos Jacket dyed Loam Brown, your Dreadworm Bracers of Scouting, your Tantalus Breaches dyed Shadow Blue, and any dyeable feet piece dyed Loam Brown. Once you've got yourself all glammed up, head on over to the Golden Saucer, teleport over to Wonder Square East, hop down over the railing, and present yourself for judging at the Masked Rose. He'll do his usual speech, and there you go. Easy 60,000 MGP, as well as the Fashion Leader title. All right, that'll do it for me though, everybody. If you could leave a like if you found this video helpful, that would really help me out. Head over to my Twitter and comment on this video with your Fashion Report glam for this week. And subscribe to the channel for more Final Fantasy XIV and Dawn Trail content.